As in the previous two videos, we have seen a couple of ways for implementing the WCF services. Now, in this particular video, we'll see how to host those services so that a client can consume it. So here we have four ways that is IS hosting. IS is Internet Information Services, which is already there in any Windows operating system. So first of all, you will have to configure the IS and once you are done with that, you can host any WCF service. Self-hosting. In self-hosting, basically we will create our own application with a code and that application will be behaving as a server where we will host the WCF service. Apart from that, we do have WAS hosting and Windows services hosting means hosting your WCF service as the Windows service. So in the coming four videos, we'll cover all these four techniques using which you can host the WCF service differently for the different purposes.